And step aside from your soccer balls now because we've done some warm up games, we did some loosening stuff, so we're just going to do some little stretching stuff, what we call dynamic stretches, just to make sure you guys are, are really ready to go. So what I'd like you to do, just find some space, but make sure you can see me. And without your soccer balls, first thing we're going to do, we're just going to walk around and every couple of steps, we're going to go up on our toes and just hold for a few seconds and then walk down and walk around. If you can walk around the soccer balls, that's great. Don't bump into anybody, don't touch the balls. Off you go. Just going up on your toes, stretching the back of your legs. Off you go, guys. There, now the next one, you've got to be careful where you're going because you're going to walk backwards. As you take a step back, you're just going to sit back like this and just drop down and touch your toe. Can everyone do that? And then you come up, take a step back and drop down and touch your toe again. That's it. And keep this front leg nice and straight. Make sure you don't bump into anybody. Okay. Next one, guys. Just shake up. Okay. As you walk along, you're going to lift up your leg with your knee here. Bring it around to the middle. So lift it up to the side. Bring it around to the middle. Can we all do that? Let's have a look. Very good, very good. Keep that head up and in. Okay, and next one, it's gonna be similar, but backwards, you're gonna go up to the middle first and then open up to the side. Take a couple of steps, open up to the side. Okay, so we're just doing some movement-based stretches rather than static stretches, uh, just to, to get the guys loose, we don't like to, to think of um, static stretching too much. We want everything to be soft and pliable rather than uh, uh, stretching and, and potentially ripping. Facing, you're going to take a big step to the side and just drop down, hold for a couple of seconds, and then slide your foot along the ground and go again. And hold, and come up, and go. Excellent stuff. And the last one, you're going to walk around every three steps. You're going to take a big step and go down like this. Hold for a couple of seconds and come up. Then take a big step and drop down. Don't let this knee touch the ground though. 